welcome to another video here is our math challenge for today we want to find x in this problem you know 110 can be written as 10 dot 11 then divided by 1 plus x plus y this is 11 dot 11 divided by 1 plus x bracket all square equals 2 of the rent then we have the first one we take out 10 from here we are going to have this as 11 divided by 1 plus x bracket plus as well so this is just like 11 square and the whole of this is 11 divided by 1 plus x so the whole of this raised to the power of 2 equals 2 cents and uh, for this we have 11 over 1 plus x comma we are going to let it to be another letter suppose i choose letter u equals 11 divided by 1 plus x so anyway i see it i'm going to replace it with u then we have 10 u plus u to the power 2 equals uh 200 so let's take 200 to the left hand side we have u square plus 10 u minus 200 equals 0 and this is a quadratic equation so which you can factorize it because it is factorizable so we are going to take uh, u square plus if this is 20u minus 10u minus 200 equals 0. So let's combine the effects two together, which is u square plus 20u. We bracket this minus then here is 10u plus 200 equals 0. So we take out minus and everything become positive uh, in the second sum. So for this we have u bracket u plus 20. Then why we take out 10 here? We have u plus 20 as well equals 0. So by combining this together, we have u plus 20 bracket and also u minus 10 equals 0. So here are the two factors of the quadratic equations above as u plus 20 equals 0 or we have u minus 10 equals 0 therefore u equals minus 20 and we have u equals uh, 10 as we got the two roots for the quadratic equation above we're now going to recall from where we let u equals 11 divided by 1 plus x and uh, uh, we substitute this for the first case we have 11 divided by 1 plus x equals minus 20 and when we take the cross multiplication for this we have 11 equals minus 20 bracket 1 plus x and again we have 11 equals let's open the parenthesis we have minus 20 minus 20 x and uh, we take minus 20 to the left hand side it becomes positive therefore we have 11 plus 20 equals minus 20 x 11 plus 20 is 31 uh, equals minus 20x and uh, divide both sides by minus 20 to get the value of x. Therefore, we have x equals minus 31 divided by 20 as the first solution to the value of x. While for the second solution, we're also going to be equating 11 divided by 1 plus x equals 10. For this, we still cross multiply and we have 10 bracket 1 plus x. So by opening the parentheses at the right hand side, we have 10 plus 10x. And taking 10 to the left hand side, it becomes negative and we have 11 minus 10 equals 10x. So 11 minus 10 is 1 equals 10x. And we divide both sides by 10. And we are going to have x equals 1 divided by 10. 10, which gives the second solution to the given problem. On getting this, we are going to uh, verify these two roots if it's going to be equal or not. You know, from this question, so the first method I apply is very, very effective. So the thing I'm going to do here now is we are trying to take the LCM of the left hand side. As we know, the LCM of this is 1 plus x all raised to the power of 2. 
and when we take one out of this from what we have uh here we are going to have one ten bracket one plus x plus so a is 121 everything equals 200 and with this what we are going to do next is since we have the value of x as 1 divided by 10 we try to substitute it in this to check if it is going to be equals to our drain so we have this as 1 10 bracket 1 plus 1 divided by 10 plus 121 all divided by 1 plus 1 over 10 raised to power of 2 our aim is to check if this is to our drain or not so when we find the LCM of the parentheses above, we have 11 divided by 10 plus 121 divided by, so the same thing with this, we have 11 divided by 10 all raised to power 2. Therefore, we have, so 11 here, uh, we have 11, the 11 multiplied by 11, that is 121 plus 121 all divided by, so now 11 square is 121 as well, and 10 square is 100. So by adding 121 plus 121 at the denominator of this, we are going to have it as 242. So then when we take the reciprocal of this, we are going to multiply this one by 100 divided by 121. And at this stage, so we know 121 can easily go in uh, 242 in uh, two times. So by having that, we are going to get the value of uh, of this, which everything is equivalent to 200. So here is 1 and uh, here is 2. Then to multiply by 100, that is 200, and it is equal to the left hand side. And here is how to do this. So definitely the second one will also satisfy it when we try it, and uh, it will be equal. Thanks for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more questions like this. See you in the next class.